I'm joined by the Senior Associate Commissioner Content Strategy at the America East Conference, Sean Tainch. And Sean, we're ready to talk Hercules Tires AE playoffs. The women's basketball quarterfinals start on Sunday. It's hard to believe, Sam. You know, we learned anything this year is we need to be flexible. Uh, so starting a little earlier than we expected, but really excited for, for these playoffs to get going. But I'd say as the, the women's basketball content in our league, you know, our expert within the office, I think it was a really fun regular season. So two teams really established themselves in Maine and Stony Brook. Uh, talk about them a little bit. They'll have buys this weekend, but what's so impressive about them? Yeah, you're looking at the last two regular season champions. It's Maine with the one seed this year after Stony Brook earned it last year. But defense, these are two of the top 10 defensive teams in the entire country. And I have to talk about Maine specifically as the regular season champ. And they have Blanca Milan, the first female student athlete in this league's history to be named player of the year and defensive player of the year multiple times for each. She is absolutely a must watch. And these two teams have been the best for the last two seasons. So, uh, you know, well deserving of those buys and looking forward to seeing them in the semis. They'll be sitting and watching uh, ESPN Plus on Sunday, awaiting the, the winners from two exciting quarterfinal matchups we had. Yeah, once again, we have UMass Lowell at the number three seed. They'll get to host a game, and they'll bring in the America East newcomer, NJIT, making its first AE playoffs appearance and first season in the league. UMass Lowell did sweep the season series here, so we know it's tough to beat a, a team three times in one season, Sean. And in the other quarterfinal matchup it's you albany back in that number four spot ninth time in 10 years the great danes have earned a top four seed they'll host new hampshire number five seed for the second straight year this time under head coach kelsey hogan in her first year with the team and this was another sweep where new hampshire went to you albany you albany did sweep new hampshire so uh interesting quarterfinal scenarios where we know as i said hard to beat a team three times in one year as I said, you can watch all the action on ESPN Plus on Sunday. You can also uh, join the conversation, use the hashtag AE Playoffs um, on Twitter and Instagram. Follow us at AE Hoops News. That's where all the action is going to be. Um, and also check out Playoff Central at AmeriCast.com for updated scores, brackets, and highlights following the games. Uh, Sam, we're really looking forward to things getting going on this Sunday. Should be a great two matchups and then semifinals next weekend. Thanks, Sean.